What is up, boxing fans? So we have some decisive time frames. Uh, let's just put it that way to uh, to keep it as light as possible. Uh, Todd Grisham was just on a podcast, Levels podcast, that was streamed on Facebook with Sports Nista and Rambling Ralph, and he revealed the final fighter showcase and a few other tidbits. Without any further ado, let's jump right into it. This is Edward, and you're watching Boxing Fanatico. So this video is going to be quite short. It was a podcast, very wholesome. Uh, I was there basically for the entire podcast watching it. Uh, and I, I just love the back and forth, the communication that they were having, the way they were talking about the game and how much excitement everyone has for the game. It, it, it makes me giddy because I have the same excitement. Uh, I had that same feeling, that same uh, giddiness to want this game to come out and be able to play the game. So, a few things were talked about, but we're going to talk about the specifics that you guys are probably more interested in. Uh, so, he touched on the fact that there wasn't a fighter reveal, that major fighter announcement. It was supposed to happen, but Todd said that, well, they got a few guys they got a few major guys, and he figured it doesn't make so much sense to just throw those few guys into this one thing. He'd rather just do the final fighter announcement show. So this third announcement show is the final one. Apparently, there's not going to be another one, uh, but that doesn't mean that there isn't going to be you know more reveals later down the line as he said when the game comes out they're going to be updating the gaming adding more fighters but he stated that this is going to be the biggest of the, of the all the fighters this is going to be the most you know the biggest show of all of the uh of the three shows so this fighter final fighter announcement show will take place according to todd uh, who's actually the one doing all this stuff next week so we're going to get the final fighter announcement show next week it will include that major fighter and multiple major fighters that were i guess those deals were done during that process so we're going to get everything put together, edited well, everything nice and 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 pretty and we're going to get that fighter final announcement show. Now there were some stuff that he talked about, but I do want to add this caveat and this warning. Do not go crazy if these dates do not come to fruition because they are targets the same way they the same way uh Fawad when interviewed said that Q1 was a target but when things you know push comes to shove and they need to make uh, and they need to focus on a specific date on what to do or or enhance the game a little bit more or add a few more features or sharpen it up a little bit more things get pushed so please do not take this as the set in stone date because when game development there is no set in stone date but he was asked when they will be able to see this for consoles and his response remember take it with a grain of salt as he's not in the development studio but his response was late fall early winter as the target so late fall early winter as the target for uh the the release for the console so we know that summer is the target for uh the early access will which will release on pc and then late fall early winter does fall in line with what they said that they wanted to be in early access for at least three months before they you know before they come out on uh for full release but also Keep in mind that that could be pushed depending on the uh, user feedback because early access is us basically part of the development cycle and giving them our feedback on the game. But also, also, Rambling Ralph said to him, I know you can't say all of the special referees that you guys have acquired, but that's going to be great. It's looking like we might get referees, specific referees actual referees 
like a Kenny Bayless or a Richard Steele or a Tony Weeks. We're probably gonna get actual referees put into the game and that seems fantastic if that's the case. I wouldn't mind seeing them revealed as well. <laughs> a referee reveal would be, would be cool. Uh, but yes, get ready. The final fighter announcement show. Since it's the final one, they're probably gonna try to go out with a bang. The final fighter announcement show is next week sometime next week so keep your eyes peeled i will be doing a live stream for that we're gonna all come together watch it and, and have fun talk about the fighters talk about everything just you know enjoy enjoy the day and i'm positive it's gonna be a blast because the last two fighter announcements were absolute fire awesome podcast if you haven't seen it you can go ahead and uh, check the link down in the description box below you can go over to their facebook page watch the podcast. I, I'm, I'm sure they're going to archive it. So you'll be able to just watch it from beginning to end as they're talking with crowd as they're talking with Todd Grisham and they're focusing their entire interview on the ESBC game. So it's a very, very uh, fun interview to watch. That's all I have for today, guys. Remember to stay tuned next week for the final fighter announcement show. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.